If Jesus came to your house to spend a day or two, if he came without warning, I wonder what you'd do. It might be interesting to know just how you'd feel if Jesus came to your house to visit you for real. Yes, if Jesus came to your house to spend a day or two, if he came unexpected, just dropped in on you. Oh, I know you'd give your nicest room to such an honored guest. And all the food you'd serve him would be the very best. And you'd keep assuring him you were glad to have him there. That serving him in your home was joy beyond compare. But when you saw him coming, would you meet him at the door? With arms outstretched in welcome to your heavenly visitor? Or would you have to change your clothes before you let him in? And hide some magazines and put the Bible where they'd been? Would you turn off the radio and hope he hadn't heard? And wish you hadn't uttered that last loud hasty word? Would your family conversation keep its usual pace? Would you find it hard each meal to say a table grace? Would you sing the songs you always sing and read the books you always read? And let him know the things on which your mind and spirit feed? Would you take Jesus with you everywhere you plan to go? Or would you maybe change your plans for just a day or so? Would you be glad to have him meet your very closest friends? Or would you hope they'd stay away until his visit ends? Would you be glad to have him stay forever on and on? Or would you sigh with great relief when he at last was gone? It might be interesting to know the things that you'd do if Jesus came to your house to spend some time with you.